In this tutorial you will see how to create a 2-3 poster style using any of our templates unlimited poster templates. We will be using the Rugby 12 by 18 poster template to create a 2-3 poster for rugby player. The template and three photos are already open in Photoshop. If the layers palette is not in view or open, go to window and click on layers to open or hit the F7 key. Hide the color border. Border. And place pick here layers by clicking on the eye icon. Click on the color background layer. We are going to add the photos above this layer. Select one of the photos to start with. The photo order does not matter. We are starting with photo number 3. So that we can edit the photo and have a transparent background, we need to make a copy of the background layer. To make a copy, drag the background layer down to the new layer icon. Then hide the background layer and use the background copy layer. We are going to show how to feather a photo. To begin, click on the rectangular marquee tool to make your current tool. The feather amount will be the max at 250 pixels. Draw a rectangle around the subject, trying to keep her in the center does not have to be perfectly centered. We are going to move the selection a bit by going to Select, Transform Selection. With Elements, you will have to undo and select again. Move the selection up to the left a bit. This is so that we are sure that the player's face will not be feathered. Hit the Enter key or click on the check mark to finish the selection. Go to Select, Inverse, then to Edit, Clear or hit the Delete key. And then Select, Deselect. The photo is now ready to drag into Poster. Drag photo into Poster template and drop anywhere. Make the Move tool your current tool. Move photo to about where you would like it. Do a Ctrl plus click on the photo's layer thumbnail to select the photo to feather more. Go to Select, Inverse, then Edit, Clear, to twice or Hit the delete key two times. Go to select. Deselect. We are going to rename the background copy layer, Photo 3 since this was already named Photo 3 when we opened it. This will help keep the layers better organized and quicker to edit plus being sure that you are editing the right layer. Minimize photo or close and do not save changes. Select next photo to feather and add to poster. We will repeat the same steps as with the previous photo. To make a copy, drag the background layer down to the new layer icon. Then hide the background layer and use the background copy layer. Click on the rectangular marquee tool to make your current tool. The feather amount will be the max at 250 pixels. Draw a rectangle around the subject, trying to keep her in the center. Does not have to be perfectly centered. Go to Select, Inverse. Then to Edit, Clear or hit the Delete key. And then Select, Deselect. The photo is now ready to drag into poster. Drag photo into poster template and drop anywhere. Make the move tool your current tool. Move photo to about where you would like it. Do a control plus click on the photo's layer thumbnail to select the photo to feather more. Go to select. Inverse. Then edit. Clear. To twice or. Hit the delete key two times. 
Go to Select. Deselect. Rename layer to Photo 1, since this photo was already called Photo 1. Minimize photo or close and do not save changes. Select next photo to feather and add to poster. We will repeat the same steps as with the previous photo. To make a copy, drag the background layer down to the new layer icon. Then hide the background layer and use the background copy layer. Draw a rectangle around the subject, trying to keep her in the center. Does not have to be perfectly centered. We are going to move the selection a bit by going to Select, Transform Selection. With Elements, you will have to undo and select again. Move the selection up to the left a bit, this is so that we are sure that the player's face will not be feathered. Hit the Enter key or click on the check mark to finish the selection. Go to Select, Inverse. Then to Edit, Clear or hit the Delete key. and then select. Deselect. The photo is now ready to drag into poster. Drag photo into poster template and drop anywhere. Rename layer to photo 2. Just in case we feather out too much we are going to make a copy of this layer. Sometimes when using a full body photo, when you feather you can feather fade their face too much. We make a copy just in case this happens, so we can put a layer mask on the backup layer, to paint the face back in. Select both layers, by holding down the Shift key. Link these layers and then hide the copy layer. Click on the Photo to layer. Then do a Ctrl plus click on the layer thumbnail to select to feather. Go to Select. Inverse. Then edit, clear, twice or. Hit the delete key two times. Go to Select. Deselect. Make Move Tool Current Tool. We are going to move the full body photo to the lower left. Click on Photo 1 and move to the right and middle. We are going to scale larger. Edit. Transform. Scale. Maintain aspect ratio. Increase 10% by typing in 110%. Hit enter or check mark. We are going to scale up again 10%. Edit. Transform. Again. This will repeat the last transformation, in this case is scale 110%. Also by using again, you do not need to hit enter or check mark. We are going to add a layer mask and paint out the second girl, since it detracts from the main subject. Click on the Photo 1 layer and then click on New Layer Mask icon to add a layer mask. Click on Layer Mask to be sure that is what you will be painting on. Set black as foreground and white as background color. Make the brush tool your current tool. Pick a large, soft, round brush. For a 12 by 18 poster, we will most likely want to increase the brush size. The exact number is not important. Mode, Normal, Flow, 100%. Lower the opacity to about 70%. Start painting out the second girl. And paint out some of the background, so that the main subject stands out more. Click on the Photo 3 layer. Make Move Tool the current tool. Move the photo a bit. We are going to scale the photo up 10%. Edit. Transform. Scale. Maintain aspect ratio. Type in 110%. Hit enter or check mark. Rotate a bit. Edit. Transform. 
rotate. The exact amount is not important. Hit the Enter key or click on check mark to complete the rotate. Click on Photo 2 layer. Add a layer mask to Photo 2. Click on the new layer mask to be sure that is what you are painting on. Black as foreground color. White as background color. Large soft round brush. Opacity 70%. Paint out some of the background. Move Photo 2 under Photo 1 on the Layers Palette. Scale Photo 2 up 10%. By using Edit Transform Scale Maintain Aspect Ratio, type in 110% Repeat Scale again. And then rotate a bit in the opposite direction of the top left photo. Edit, Transform, Rotate. Hit Enter or click on check mark to finish. Tweak, move a bit, if you feel that would look better. Start to edit, update, the text. Update the year. To do this, make the text tool your current tool, and drag the cursor over the text to edit. In this case we are changing the 06 to 1 0. Hit the Enter key or check mark to finish editing. Continue to edit the rest of the text that needs updating. Tip. If you have a roster or email with the player's name then do a copy and paste for the player's name. This will help cut down the chances of misspelling their name.